Hey guys, it's Goofy Flip, and today we're going to be looking at how to create the static visual effect which uh, you get from TVs when they're untuned. First, you want to make a new composition, and you'll have your black square there. And you want to go up to Layer, New, and a new solid. And make it comp size, and make it a white solid, and hit OK. So now you've got your white solid there. What you want to do is you want to go up to Effect, or you want to select your white solid, go up to Effect, go down to Noise and Grain, and add a fractal noise effect, and you'll get this, which is a kind of a cloudy black and white. Now you'll see that you have contrast here. What contrast does is it changes basically the contrast between the two colors. So the higher it is, the more difference there'll be between the blacks and the whites. So what you want to do is you want to go down to transform and click off uniform scaling and change the scale width to a really high number, around 3,000, 4,000, it doesn't really matter. And what you'll, and then you take the scale height completely down and you'll get these black and white lines, black, white and grey lines, which go across the screen. And then you want to go down to evolution and alt click it and you'll get this box here and you want to change that to time asterisk 1000 and then just click away from the box. Now you'll see that when you render it or move the timeline along the lines go up and down the screen so you're halfway there to making that realistic static effect. Now what you want to do is you want to go to layer new and make a whole new solid again make it the comp size okay and you want to basically repeat the same steps so go to noise and grain fractal noise now this time you want to go to transform again but don't click off uniform scaling and just change the scale down to about 10 and you'll get this grain effect you can change the contrast slightly if you want and you want to go to evolution again and alt click and this time put time to a thousand or ten thousand uh, it doesn't really matter what number you put up and now you'll see that you have the dots moving around like this now what you want to do is you want to put them together so the way you do that is you select um, your dot go to blending mode then go to overlay and this joins the two planes together so now when you render you have this really nice static effect which you can use in any of your films it really works and it's just a great simple effect which takes almost no time to do anyway this has been Goofy Flip I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial remember to rate, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next Wednesday with my next tutorial